Okay, how about now? Is there sound now? Is there sound beyond Beauty 3? I hope so. Still no sound? Okay, there should be sound. Let's see here. What if I take these off? Hitchup says yes. So I was wondering. Okay, these are turned off now. Is there still sound? Gosh, I hope so. It's a moving day. We all know how moving days suck. So a little bit crazy it says it's working. Is it working now? Okay, let's put these on. Wait for the audio to kick in. I'm waiting. There it goes. Okay, now I got sound. Hello, Jen Vargas, Central Florida Top 5. Uh, is there audio now? Oh, hopefully everything's working good. I'm just going to take it that it is. Some people says it sounds great. Blue Wave Odyssey says it sounds great. Uh, who else says it sounds great? Misty Pruitt says it sounds good. Okay, so headphones are on. Perfect for the quick 60-second shout-out. But before I do... Uh, I, I, I wrote something down in, in my comments. My green screen is totally messing up. For some reason, white messes up a green screen when you don't have the proper lighting. Let me see if I can fix that real fast. Um, I wrote a list of fun... Of, oh, okay, that might, that might work right there. I wrote down a list of talking points. Uh, basically the same thing I do every week. And one of the last things I wanted to talk about is going to have to be one of the first things because I uh, copied and pasted somebody in here's uh, YouTube channel and I wanted to share them out because I started really liking that person's channel. They've been putting out some great content recently and I think everybody should go over there and check them out. So while I have their link copied, I'm going to go ahead and paste it in the feed here. And this is uh, Gina Payne's channel. And if everybody would possibly check that out when you get a spare chance, she does some pretty incredible stuff. I never really focused on her channel before until this week. I know Blue Wave Bob always shouts her out and talks about how great her channel is, but I never really focused on her videos before. And wow, they are really good. Uh, and it got, got me where I'm just sucked in sometimes. And you just watch the next video and the next video. So anyway, I wanted to give a, a quick shout out to Gina Payne. She's been uh, talking in some of my videos, leaving comments and stuff. And, and I decided to go over to her channel, check her stuff out. And I really liked it. And uh, I think you guys will too if you're not. I'm pretty sure we're all friends with her. But the issue is... Um, Sometimes we, we it, it's so hard in our community. There's so many channels. We can't watch everybody's videos all the time. So sometimes we just have to jump, jump around, jump, 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 jump around. And uh, yeah, so uh, if, if you haven't jumped, jump, jump, jumped around a little bit over to uh, Van Life with Gina, uh, Gina Payne, uh, maybe it's time because uh, some pretty incredible content there. Anyway. I'm going to go ahead and do what I normally do at the beginning of my streams. We got some fun stuff to open up here on camera. My members only already seen kind of what it is. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and show you guys live in the stream. Uh, it's, it's some pretty fun stuff. I think you're going to enjoy it. But before we get to that, I want to go ahead, put a link in here. Uh, I'm going to copy uh, my link here to this stream and uh, post it. And if anybody wants to come in real fast and do a 60-second shout-out to their channel, if you're new to this stream or new to any of these people in the stream, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, you need to tell us about your channel. I haven't been home like in 30 days, and somehow there's this one little gnat flying around in Cousin Eddie, and he just keeps bugging me, and the cat is not doing her job. Anyway, let me go ahead and uh, post this link here. Uh, so what we like to do is let a person come in and uh, for 60 seconds, talk about their channel, tell them, tell us and everybody in the stream here why we would love watching your channel. That, that, that That's it. So if anybody wants to come in, I swear I'm going to get him. This gnat is harder to kill than Tom oh, Tommy Travels leaving... Super chats. 
can't 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 stop that guy. Thank you, Tommy Travels. Much I, I appreciate it. Your uh video today on Wisconsin Dells was amazing. I've been to Wisconsin Dells quite a bit, but never in that part of town. And I've never actually seen the Dells. I never knew what a Dells was until I went out uh, to uh, Portland, Oregon, and you drive down the Columbia River Gorge, and there's Dells all through there. And I, I never knew what a Dells was. I just thought it was the name of a town. I didn't know a Dell was like a lock in the river, kind of like a dam, you know, and I didn't know when I, when I think of Wisconsin Dells, I never thought, well, maybe the river has some sort of dam and spillway to slow up the water a little bit. I didn't, I never knew that until I watched your video today. And uh, yeah, that was, that was a, that was a great travel video, Tommy. I loved it. And thank you so much for the super chat. All right. Well, I'm waiting for people to pop in the room and uh, hit some talking points. Uh, I want to go ahead and, and uh, thank over the hill RV for being number. I think, I think they're number one in the room. They were the very first people. Uh, I'm going to guess because that's as far as I can scroll up. Oh, no, I can scroll up further. Uh, no. Nope. Okay, it's showing James Catanese. I don't know who the first person in the room was tonight. It, it StreamYard does not let you scroll all the way to the top. When I, I don't know how many comments it lets you go. So let's just start with James. James Catanese, hello, uh, hope everything's going good at home. I know we communicate throughout the day sometimes, and I hope everything's going a-okay with you. Uh, I know you sent something here. Uh, it not, I only uh, I only got one package today, and it's right here, um, and it's from a company, and I'm expecting another package from another company. I, I, I want to talk about that a little bit. It's because of you guys that certain things are starting to happen in my life, and uh, I, I thank you guys so much. Beyond Beauty 3 is in the room. Uh, uh, let's see here. Hitch up and tow. Uh, little bit crazy. Blue Wave Odyssey. Who I just talked to on the phone a little bit ago. It, but he not in there. Okay, I've scrolled so far up it's saying no sound. Hitch up and tow saying no sound. No sound. Yep, sound. Beyond Beauty says. So I get into the point where the yeps, there's sound. And Posh Cat's camping is saying perfect. So, and blue, hold on, Blue Wave is saying better. So some people are saying the sound is great. Some people, like Blue Wave, are just saying it's better. Is better awesome or better just better? I, I, I don't know. It's driving me crazy. I didn't get to do my audio test. I didn't have time to do the audio test. Uh, Ozark Pathfinders is in the room. Hello, Ozark Pathfinders. Artist on the road. Hello, hello. Uh, Van Life with Gina Payne. She's here. That's a channel. Anybody that's not friends with Gina really should be friends with her and uh, check out some of her content. Uh, she rigs up taillights like I would. I, I don't know how to do half the stuff. That's why Box Van D blows me away. She she can do anything. She's not afraid to tear into the air, tear the shelves down, do you know, move, you know, unbolt the couches and chairs and move stuff around and I'm afraid to do all that stuff. I, I actually want to make Cousin Eddie a little bigger by removing things like the dining room table and the the bench seating over here. But I don't know how to do it. And I'm kind of afraid to start doing it. But uh, ladies like uh, Box Van D and Gina Payne, they, they, know, they, they get right into it. Farm Yoki is in the room. Hey, y'all. Jen Vargas, Central Florida Top 5 uh, and new member. I will be hanging out with you soon i'm home right now uh jen uh, uh I'm, I'm i'm home right now but uh i leave tuesday so what is today saturday i think so today's saturday uh so sunday and monday i'm gonna work on cousin eddie get him cleaned up a little bit and then tuesday i have to be in alachua alachua florida and then uh i'm home and so I went ahead and contacted Top Golf. I have a bay set up for 2 p.m. on the 29th. So it's drinks, food, and whacking golf balls. And hopefully you will be there with me to smack some golf balls. I'm, I'm assuming. Balls. Balls is funny because the thing I want to talk about tonight is protecting balls. 
you, you'll see what I'm talking about in a, in a few. Uh, and Universal Studios on the third. Me and you, we're going to be allowed into the park on the third. Uh, so uh, I guess the Universal's opening up to the general public on the fifth. So uh, hopefully uh, we can meet up on the third and uh, finally do the Harry Potter roller coaster. That's my plan before the crowds get in. So uh, I'll talk to you after the stream, I'm sure. Okay, now Bob says it sounds great. So I must be I must be way behind. Uh, nursing our travel bug says still working. Hitch up and toe. Posh cats. I'm scrolling down to see everybody that's in the room uh, and seeing if I'm missing any messages. Uh, da, da, da. Captain Jack Scrapper is in the room. Hello, I'm, I'm I'm assuming you're going on live after me tonight, Captain Jack. Something else I want to talk about uh, that that uh, something that happened within our community this week, and uh, so it, it's going to be a little bit difficult to figure out when people are going on. But everybody is, you know what? I'll just talk about it before. Let me scroll down here to the bottom. So we got James Cantonese. I'm just looking for people that might be in here. Uh, Smith Conkin, what is this? I hope you're well. Oh, Smithy's Kontiki has the word Tiki in it, so I'm good. Uh, over the hill, hitch up a toe, Misty Pruitt. Hello, Misty Pruitt. How are you doing today? Uh, uh, let's see here. Uh, boo, boo, boo. I don't want to miss anybody's thing. We're down to Tommy Travel's thing here. Uh, just I'm just going through here. Okay, real fast. Uh, okay, now I'm down towards the bottom. Uh, I was, but Captain Jack wrote something. He wrote, uh, I may need to try cotton or something. Who knows, LOL. I do have a dead squirrel to try. Not, I did not kill a squirrel, P.S., I guess. <laughs> I don't, did I get him? I almost killed a gnat. Um, okay, so a, a company, let me, let me pull up this email. There, there was supposed to be a package delivered today. Uh, hold on here. Yes, I will do the half hour, but I cannot remember who I introduced after me. Tonight should be uh, artists on the road, I believe. I believe I, I got to talk. I, I'm going to talk about uh, them a little bit. Uh, also here in a little in just a few. Let Thank you, Beyond Beauty. Look at you, girl. You don't need to be doing that. My life is positive. You know, I, I'm, I live a positive life. I don't, you know, I, I, I appreciate the positive vibes, but I'm pretty much always positive, except for the other day. I was falling under like a super depressed state, but I was still positive at the same time. So I actually don't know if I was depressed or not. Um, I don't know. I, I, I was in a weird state of mind, and uh, there I, I was stuck on the side of the road for two days, on the shoulder of the road. And uh, it was gloomy, rainy, Virginia-type day, and I was, uh, I was feeling it. I was feeling kind of blah, but at the same time, I was still positive. So I, I, I appreciate the positivity, though. I, I do. Uh, let me go ahead, and, and I'm going to open up an email. So I can get the name of this company correct. <clears throat> Ooh, here's another company uh, that wants to do the same thing this other company just did. Um, I think I put it under work file. I'm, I'm going on my phone right now. I think I, I put it under work. Let's see. Okay. The company is uh, Fifine, F I. F I N E. I guess they have microphones. Uh, they asked me if I would do an unboxing video, and they would send me a free microphone. And I, uh, it's supposedly here, but it's not here. Amazon shows delivered, but it's not here. So I don't know what's going on. Uh, but uh, I don't know how many of you guys have ever done this stuff. Uh, when you make a video, when a company sends you stuff like that, is that a sponsored video? I, I'm just curious. I'm, I, am I supposed to say this is a sponsored video, or am I? I, I I'm I'm going to say that 
the company sent me something, obviously, and they want me to test it out and, and uh, do a review on it. But is, is that a sponsorship? I don't know. They didn't send me a promo code that I know of. I'm going to try and get one. But uh, Fifine, I don't know if any of you guys use their products, their microphones. But, uh, yeah, they, they sent that here. But another company sent me something. It did come. I'll talk about that in a second. But I was actually curious. Uh, I've Things like this, people do send stuff sometimes, but they often say, it's not sponsored. We want an honest opinion. Uh, they do. They said I can leave an honest opinion on YouTube, but they actually want me to also do a video for Amazon, where which is a, a strict unboxing and my thoughts of the unboxing on Amazon. And I'm just curious: uh, is it sponsored? If they don't give you a promo link to give out to everybody else. Anyway, so let's see what the comments are here. It, uh, Bob is saying it's a review video. So if I just say this is a review video of a product that they sent me, not specifically a sponsored video, right? Because they're not paying, but they are going to give me a, a, a one to send to one of you guys. So I got I, I got two of them, one for myself, and then I got a, a, a code to order off of Amazon to send one of you guys one. So I, like I said, I don't know if that's sponsored. Hold on. Is Alex in the room? At, what in the heck, Alex? Are they paying for it? Alex says, hey, uh, I hope to... Damn that. I hope to see you on my trip home. I cannot kill this stupid thing. Uh, are they paying me for it? No, Alex. Uh, they... Ow. They are not paying me for it. They're just sending... Pro I'm going to get this thing. I swear. I have some Hornet spray, you know, because in the RVs, you know that little vent you have on the outside of your motorhome that for some reason wasps love going in there. You park, you set up, next thing you know, there's wasps flying in. And then they're coming out of your oven or somewhere crazy. Those big black killer looking wasps. Uh, I got that sealed up now, and I, bought, I did buy some of that wasp Hornet spray. I'm about ready to go crazy with that in here. Uh, Alex, this is like, uh, I'm blown away that you're in my stream, actually. I don't think you've ever, I don't even know if you've ever watched one of my videos, but man, I love you. I'm, I'm so glad you're here. I hope you're doing okay in Tampa. And like I said, I hope you're uh, going to be around for a week or two uh, while I'm at the Thousand Trails in Claremont. Uh, but no, they are not paying me. Uh, let me find that. Okay, so... Uh, Nomadic hippie, or no, uh, nomadic uh, Captain Jack says, Amazon order same today or came today. Not sure whether I should keep it. I think Amazon has growing is growing pain. I Amazon's having a hard time right now. I ordered a girl uh, something up in Metropolis, Illinois, a pair of cowboy boots. Actually, you know the girl, the one that I had googly eyes for, for a short time. Still do, but. She doesn't know that. Uh, sent her some boots, and it showed delivered through the US, U.S. Postal Service as left on the front porch. It never showed up because I know they were waiting on the front porch for the post office to deliver the stuff, but it never came. And uh, this here, may, it's a holiday, right? It's a holiday weekend, so maybe they messed up. Uh, uh, Bob says, uh, like you said, just mentioned they gave it to you to review okay well that's what i'll do and that's what's going on with this product right here that i will show you here in just a little bit jen vargas central florida top five said <laughs> no i gotta say film slam right florida film slam that's what i need to start saying uh it, 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 if anybody remembers jen vargas she was one of the uh uh first people i interviewed on my channel uh Actually, Nick's Picks, I believe, is in the room, and she won the contest to go one of the film slams before this whole craziness started happening. Hopefully, uh, before the Halloween season comes and the, and the film slam starts showing the independent films for Halloween season, uh, all that will start happening soon. But uh, Nick's Picks, that there's Jen right here. Jen's right there. <coughs> She, uh, Jen says, you must disclose that a company sends an item to you for free. Okay, so that's it. That's what I need to disclose. 
And that's what I'll disclose here in a, in a few minutes with this other fun thing. Artists on the Road, which I believe comes on right after me, right? You come on right, uh, right after me. If they aren't paying you, it's not sponsored. Okay, good. Uh, I wouldn't say it's been sent. Just do an honest review. They said I'm allowed to do an honest review, so. And I got two units. So it's a lav mic. It's going to be a lav mic. So supposedly, um, it's plug and play. Works on any device. Uh, so I'm, I'm kind of excited. Uh, but I'll, I'll do that maybe next week. We'll have to see. I got some more stuff coming from DJI. Uh, they liked when I talked about their little thing, the little case battery thing and they sending me something else i got an email from them that they're sending me i i don't know what it is uh, we'll just have to find out but whatever it is supposed to be here on the 30th and and that's um something that's been kind of blowing me away um once you get to a point you know you you look at these big youtubers you you look at these guys that have so much you know so many subscribers, so many whatever. Um, and, you, and you look at them and you go, wow, they get all these cool deals from Apple. They get MacBooks. They get Windows stuff. They get all this stuff. It could happen to small people like us, too. Uh, if you we're, we're a niche, you know, we're a niche. We're travelers. We uh, Some of us live full-time in motorhomes. Some of us live part-time. Some of us do beauty, like beyond beauty. Uh, uh Everybody does something different, but we all have this niche and there's these products as the cat gets behind my green screen over here. You could see you back there. She's, she's back there mess, messing it up. I know she is. Um, if you're looking for that type of stuff, it'll happen. I, I I'm, I'm realizing that now there's been stuff in the past. You get something silly, you know, something goofy from a, a company, you know, just something fun. But then other companies start sending you stuff, even with very few views. You don't have to have a lot of views, it seems. And you don't have to have a lot of subscribers. It's kind of amazing what companies will do just to catch the eyeballs of a few people. And you don't even need to go hunting for it. So I missed a lot of this stuff in my inbox. In my, I, I miss my emails so much. Sometimes I get so many emails that I'll just do a mass delete and I miss some of these things. So make sure you're actually checking your emails and and and, and a lot and none of the stuff has been in my spam folder. It's been actual right there, right there in the in the in the main feed. Uh, so any of you guys out there, uh, really check it out. Who knows? Some company want you to test out LED lights for the back of your RV or you know for the tail lights or something. They may they may send you something, maybe some external batteries for charging your devices. The companies do that stuff and uh, you really don't have to go hunting for them. Uh, Alex says, do not spray Hornets. <laughs> don't spray Hornet spray in the RV. It's underneath the kitchen. It's underneath the sink. I'm not going to grab it. Cat, The cat's up here. Uh, you might be able to see her outline right here. She's on, I, I think she's hunting, hunting right now. Um, Okay, here we go. Uh, Rode Smart Labs are great. I want to get uh, uh, the Rode Go, the, the wireless Rode Go Mini thing. I want to get that. It's like $190. Uh, if Rode will send that to me, I'd love it. I got a nice Rode shotgun mic over there, but uh, I rarely use it because it goes with my big Osmo. And uh, I just, I rarely use it. I do like this. I like this uh, Blue Yeti. That, this is a really nice, cool microphone. Uh, I, I I don't know. I'll use whatever somebody sends me. I'm, I, I, I'm happy with the internal cell phone microphones if I'm recording with my cell phone. Seems like the microphones nowadays are, are pretty good. Artist on the road says, Cat? She's, she's standing. Here, let me turn the camera. Do, do, do. She's right there. There she is. What? You're, you're, you're right here. You're, you're on camera. She's, 
she seems lethargic right now. Wait until the sun goes down, and and I have to go to bed. That's when she. That's when her springs, those springs that are all coiled up, all tight, get released, and she starts running up and down the halls. Um. Uh. Yeah. Uh. I'm, I know I'm missing so many comments. Uh. Alex says he needs to get a Mavic Mini. No, don't get a Mavic Mini. You, you don't get a Mavic Pro or a, a, a Mavic. Mavic Pro is the way to go. Or if you could find a Spark, a DJI Spark, you get more sensors. And some of those sensors are uh, you. Are, Mavic Mini is a great practice drone, but I, I for you you might as well spend the extra hundred dollars, two hundred dollars, and get a good drone. You're not spending that much more to get better quality. Uh, Mavic Mini is great to start with, but I I, I I wouldn't get one. I would not get one. Um, let's see here. Uh, but Alex, me and you always butt heads on stuff on 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 gadgets. So I but you get what you want to get. I I would just say I would save an extra week or two and spend the extra money uh let's see here uh little bit says uh the cat lol at you she oh she moved she's not there no more she's not there no more little bit all right so we're back at the bottom so let me go ahead and uh, don't tell me what to do with money alex says hello i'm not i tried to get you away from apple products like crazy it just does not work i I learned my lesson long ago. I'm I'm embracing multiple operating systems now because of you. You opened my eyes to multiple operating systems and different products. All right, guys. So uh, let me remove Alex here. Uh, before I start showing you guys this unboxing stuff, let me go ahead and talk about what I'm doing. I don't know if the green screen is going to mess this up, but here is the wall of stickers so far. This is what I got on the plexiglass. Uh, so this is all your guys' stickers that I have. And one of them's mine, obviously, right here. That one's mine. Uh, that's a practice sticker. I was going to send them out, but I'm not happy with them. Uh, but uh, I, I will be home for, uh, God, probably about 10 days. So I will go ahead and swap my backdrop here real fast with my mailing address. I probably over here. Let me go ahead and get that up. Uh, if anybody wants to send a sticker, uh, please do. Uh, green screen. Da, da, da. Here is my mailing address. Can you guys see it? Oh, let's move that away there. This is my mailing address right here. Uh, once I receive your stickers, they are going to go on this. Hopefully, there's going to be enough room or I'm going to get another piece of plexiglass. I'm going to be bringing this up to Metropolis, Illinois, and we are going to be mounting it either at the Americana Hollywood Museum or the Superman Museum. So uh, everybody coming into the museum or coming to take their photographs with the Superman statue and stuff are going to see this. And uh, it's going to have YouTube, you know, our, uh, nom nomadic YouTube channels or something. I, I, I don't know what I'll, I'll put up here. Uh, uh, stickers. And so people are, are, are going to be there and it's going to be like a photo wall opportunity for people. Right. And, uh, I was going to put them on the RV, but I thought, uh, more people would see it if it was at a pretty cool location, like the super museum. I keep looking at the palm of my hand. I don't see it. He's, he's here somewhere. Uh, so this is my address right there. If you want to take a screenshot, Did someone just take a screenshot? I just heard a ding. I, I don't know. But uh, that is the address right there. And uh, uh, if you want to send a sticker, it will go on that board. I will be leaving here probably about the 5th of next month and hopefully heading right up to Metropolis. Slap some screws through that piece of plexiglass uh, wherever they'll let me put it on the side of their building or possibly within the establishment. I. Uh, We'll, we'll figure it out and I'll let you go. I'll do a live stream while we're mounting that. And uh, got some other plans for that area also. 
hidden street cams anybody possibly who knows could be a superman 24 hour a day live camera going in could be fun all right so that is my address i know captain jack needed it earlier in the stream he was asking for it and somebody else was asking for it also so i just wanted to make sure it is there i'll leave it there for a few more minutes and uh hold on a second hold on bob is doing some virtual hunting for me he thought he's seen a speck on my monitor that's a pretty small gnat he but he's probably small enough to cover the lens of that thing it's possible he could have walked across it but i don't see him the cat's at my feet right now she's just not doing her job all right avenger rv adventure how you doing hold on what's hidden uh my address i'm trying to stay out of the way i'm getting ready to get rid of it so anybody you need it it's it's going bye bye it's leaving it's leaving hi linda barker how you doing she's saying hi to lily lily must be in the room but I don't see her. I don't know where she is. Journey via Life's Lily. There she is. New channel name. Same great videos. There you go. I, I don't know. I, I'm trying to come up with witty stuff. All right. All the ladies in the room. Uh, Blue Wave says that Nat is pesky. Oh, you don't know. They're the worst. I'm really worried. Uh, when I go, when I, when I, when I come home from my regular days off starting Wednesday, ugh, this is what happens when you don't come home for a long time. Starting Wednesday, uh, I'll be checking into Thousand Trails in Claremont. Uh, for those of you that aren't from Florida, that's considered Thousand Trails Orlando. Uh, it's in different tiers. You start off at the top when you come through the gate, then you got the whole area up by the swimming pool, tennis courts and you know whatever. Then you can go down a little bit, and uh, then you can go down a little bit more, kind of into the woods down by the lake. And I've stayed down by the lake before, but the mosquitoes down there just get crazy this time of year. So I was debating uh, staying, like, in the middle, far enough away from the pool, even though the pool's probably not going to be open. Uh, maybe closer to a bathhouse, but close enough to the woods to where I can easily ride the Segway. This, that thing right there down to the water and that way avoiding the mosquitoes avoiding the flies that surround up up near the store area because that's where their dumpsters are and uh i, I it just depends i'm really hoping that uh because i'm going in midweek that uh there's going to be some good spaces open i'm hoping it's just not totally packed i'm, I'm really worried about that okay so let me go ahead and, and take Blue Wave off here for a second. Hi, Tina's journey. All right, there we go. Journal of Journeys. Hello. Okay, so, ladies, if you're easily offended, you have to be pretty easily offended by this because this is an actual product. Uh, let me go ahead and switch the background here real fast. But uh, you might want to plug your ears or turn the volume down or hide your eyes. I'm guessing. All right. So here's a, another company sent me something pretty amazing. This is not a paid advertisement, obviously, obviously, um, because I did not get paid for it, but I did get it. So uh, I want I, I, I created a quick little video for my members only earlier today. Uh, so but I, I, I it just blows me away what this is. Uh, uh wonder if that's what the horse had oh i got more blue pills no beyond beauty i did get more blue pills i got a six month supply of these damn things i don't know what to do with them what what do i what do i do with them i i don't know but i did contact that doctor on facebook told him to stop sending them to me i have i, I can't really use them so <clears throat> no, this here is something really cool. <coughs> Excuse me. This is called Manscape. Pretty here. I don't know if you guys can see it. That's how you spell it. Uh, okay, ladies, honest. You might want to turn your head. You might want to turn your head. Uh, 
<laughs> the unboxing is, uh, pretty much explains it all. Opening up this box will explain everything. Here you guys go. Ready? Uh, okay. Gosh, I know somebody's going to get offended, but it's so awesome. Dun, dun. Oh. My balls will thank me. <laughs> Is that the most awesome unboxing ever? <laughs> I love it. Uh, look at look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? My balls are gonna feel. I, I can't even. I can't even come up with a Disney song for this. Um, crop mop. Chop cleanser, duster, foot dust. So there, this is some other stuff that doesn't have to do with uh, manscaping, I guess. On the look at this nice card, though. Uh, the modern man is a man who takes care of himself. Manscaping isn't just for life special occasions. It's a requirement for optimal health, superior hygiene, and a healthy self self esteem. Because I know if I'm not clean down there. My self-esteem just isn't where it needs to be. You now have the right tools for the safe and precise grooming in the hard-to-navigate sensitive groin area, plus post-trimming products to help keep your boys dry. I wish it would keep this gnat away. Uh, I, I wish I had Mr. Miyagi skills uh, and stay fresh all day long. So I'm going to put this little card off to the side, and let's see what is inside this box pretty nice display of, of goodness in here at the moment so the the first thing i don't know if i can get this out oh it might be difficult it's packed in pretty tight so the first thing i would like to bring to your attention is ball deodorant look at that some ball deodorant it, 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 i'm not lying it says it right there ball deodorant My cat sits on my lap all day while I drive. I think she's really going to appreciate that, I'm assuming. Have no idea what this is. This is called Ball Toner. Now, I know there's some health and beauty channels in here. Like, Beyond Beauty is big. Is my microphone still working? I hope. I don't have a red light. Is my microphone working? Oh, hold on. Oh, my microphone is not working. Hold on. Oh. Where did it go? Oh, okay. Hold on. You good? Far no. Uh, we can hear you. That's weird because my microphone is not powered up for some reason. Hmm. All right. Well, as long as you can hear me, you must be hearing me through the headset. I'm guessing. Okay. So, well, I guess it's working, but. Uh... Oh. All right. Can you hear me now? Are you able to hear me? Tell me, can you hear me? I'm hoping. Okay, you can hear me. Okay, good. Okay, I got this mic working again. All right, so this here is ball toner. Don't know what you do with it. Um, got in the fine print, and because I'm a senior citizen now, uh, the fine print is really hard. Uh, philosophy, our grooming must-haves are <sighs> I'm getting so old. I am getting so old. Uh, okay. That, wow, that did not come out clear. Uh, all right. It says some words. <laughs> There's directions here. Uh, 
for a great pick me up, spritz your your balls once or twice, let it dry. So, <laughs> okay, ball toner. Uh, it's not a tanner Avenger RV adventure, it's a toner. Should I try it? I want to try it right now. I want to try this stuff. I just, if I should get off camera, spray, spray, and tell you what I think, but uh, not going to happen. And, okay, so this here supposedly is a Manscaped something number three. Uh, supposedly, I could blindfold myself, just go to town downstairs. Oh, my, that sounded terrible. Um, oh, ooh, it vibrates. And it has a light. Not that I could see down there, I don't think. Um, it vibrates, that's good. Um, but supposedly I could just go to town and with no uh, decapitation downstairs. I don't have to worry. So this is the lawnmower. Uh, I'm shaking. I'm kind of excited. Ooh. Girls don't get all the fun stuff. Um, comes with a nice little bag of that comes with a bag it feels like a charging cable and uh, a stand so there's a charging cable and stand and a nice pouch oh i know okay so that's that's what comes in here but it looks like underneath there's more stuff so here we get a pair of our underwear is specifically engineered to prevent sweating and chafing, uh, whether, la uh, whether lounging around the house or running a marathon. Manscaped boxers will keep you cool and dry all day long. Crop cooling technology inhibits overheating uh, of your faci uh, fac facilities. Optimum pH levels. Breathable smart band technology features super elastic, wide, no roll waistband for maximum support. Got a pair of boxers. Nice. Got a, let's take this out. Uh, got a nice, nice pouch carrying bag. Kind of sweet. And check this out. An actual newspaper. It's, it, it's a full newspaper. I'm not kidding. Look at that. Is that awesome or what? That's some reading material when you go to the John. Manscaped Daily News. When was the last time you guys picked up a newspaper? Uh, sounds like they got some... Uh, one, I wonder what's playing at the movies. Is it? Look at that. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. That's, that's, that's pretty funny right there. <laughs> There's a... Oh, you guys are looking at that. I'm looking at the horoscope. It's pretty, they got a horoscope. Um, and what the hell is that seal doing? There's a seal biting. I I, I don't know what's, what's in this newspaper. But uh, thank you, Manscaped. Uh, some, looks like you got some pretty fun stuff here. Uh, I will use the product, let you know what I think about it. I'm actually really curious about... Um, I'm going to do an actual video uh, for them to thank them. But I'm, I'm curious what ball toner is. I have no idea what, what that is. Ball deodorant self-explanatory. Cat will appreciate that. Anyway, that, that was, uh, that came in, yeah, that happened. That came in the mail. Right? Please read to us Beyond Beauty says. Let me scroll up first. Uh... I might tell. I might do a video of bedtime stories from that paper. I don't know. Uh, that's for your balls, not your face. <laughs> I'm not putting it on my face. Uh, decapitation is bad, Misty. I, I'm, 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 yeah, I, I, I'm aware of that. Um, that's uh, now. I'm man groom. I mean, I'm man groom a little. I have a regular razor like that but uh you get too close sometimes i don't i i, I bleed I, I bleed super bad i just it takes the littlest cut in certain areas of my body and i need to go to the hospital it's like band-aids will not cut it cat is so cute right now 
I, I'm or I'm just a baby. I don't know. But uh, it, it's going to be nice to try that. I I I think I'm going to blindfold myself on video, and uh, go to town, and see what it's like, and and try and keep it family friendly, and uh, that way because you don't want to mess up your monetization, right? Uh, Lucky dog, uh, Lucky dog Mo uh, Productions is in here. Hello, I feel faint. Hitch up and toe says, uh, "I honest, I'm going to give an honest opinion of this. Uh, as as guys, it's hard for us to find stuff. Girls, you you walk into any store, girls, whether it's the adult type stores or a Walmart, everything is geared towards the ladies. We don't have much. Uh, so when we get something cool, it, it's uh, that's unique like this." Uh, it's a blessing. It's a blessing. Uh, did, hold on. Beyond Beauty says, did you get the butt wipes? There's no, what, do they make butt wipes? I, they didn't send me none. Uh, everything that uh, one of the pockets is open here. So one thing was not in here. Uh, I don't know what goes in there, but this is, this is the pack they sent me. So, um, uh, I'm really happy with it so far. I mean, yeah, I guess. Uh, I don't know. Uh, Van Life with Gina says, Ball Toner, LOL. It's pretty funny. Uh, should I wear my kid rock swag? Uh, eh. Don't know. Oh, you're asking Lily. Might as well. If, if Bob sent you something, Bob is Kid Rock. Um, if he sent you some stuff, why not slap it on? Uh, let's see here. Faculties, yeah. That, that was a, that was a nice way of using the words, right? Let them swing free. I, I'm curious, what do the boxers look like? Let's open these boxers up. How much time do we got? We got 10 minutes. We could open up these boxers. Um, I could probably put them on and sport them on camera. That's not bad right be like swim trunks they come in a sealed bag but there's no i'm gonna get you one of these times man i can't open them i need scissors i don't even know how they knew my size but they they pretty much got it uh, i'll check it out later i'm gonna you know fall deodorant is it a mister let's let's smell it let's see what smell what let's give it a smell test you need to read it to us. The newspaper? I'm assuming that. Eh. Okay, I, I got I got the newspaper ready to go. The the directions. Hold on. The directions are in newspaper form. Hilarious. I let's see what this stuff smells like. So, um, it's not a mister. It's this. This is ball deodorant. I there. It has a like a little cap on it. You flip it, but how do you get it out? I don't know how. You, I don't know how you get it out. There's no button or something to press. You would think it'd be so you can. It doesn't doesn't come out. Maybe I, I it's, it would be terrible if I need directions to use ball deodorant. Okay, uh, let's see here. Take a shower. I just got out of the shower. Then tell off until your goodies are dry. <laughs> uh, rub a small amount of crop preserver onto your balls and the surrounding area. Caution. Use only as directed. For external use only. Remember that, guys. Uh, I don't know if you're allowed to say certain words on YouTube. Um, okay, it says uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. These are instructions for an actual product that's not pornography. So I guess you could read the words, right? Um, for external use only. Do not. Apply directly to the tip of the penis. Stop use immediately if irritation occurs. Keep out of reach of small children. I, 
I, I, it would be great if if you could get it out of the bottle. I, you know what? I bet you there's a uh, there's paper on the end of it. That's why it wouldn't come out. Let's smell. Oh, oh! I shook it. I shook it. Oh, it smells good though. Don't shake it. Don't shake it. <laughs> Don't shake it. Um. <laughs> All this white stuff comes out if you shake it too much. <laughs> um, hold on. Might as well not waste it. Oh, okay. Ooh, ooh, okay. Uh, smells actually nice. It smells uh, pretty good. Wait, don't give me that look, cat. Don't give me that look. Um, yeah, it's kind of refreshing. Wow. Nice. I, I like it. Just don't shake the bottle uh, if you get it, if you guys get it. Um, mm. Yeah, that, that is kind of nice. Uh, uh, Beyond Beauty says, white stuff, if you shake it, I'm... Shake it, I'm dead. I... It had a piece of paper on it. I thought I was trying to tap it out. <laughs> tap it out. I was trying to get it out. Um, there's no way to talk about this stuff without it sounding like an innuendo, is there? There is no way. But then I peeled the paper off, and I guess I... Anyway, that is Manscaped. Go to their website. Check them out. Uh, this is not a sponsored video. Uh, but funness to be had. Okay, so uh, real fast, I'm going to go ahead and put the link in one more time. Hi, Tina's uh, Journey. How are you doing here? Uh, let's see. I'm dying. I thought you you don't need... Please don't die. I need you. Hey, I, I do got a question for you and Captain Jack. Those dams broke up there in Michigan. Were you guys in any danger? Uh, were you close to any of the flooding that was going on up there? I hope, and if you were, I hope everything is, is hunky-dory and that you guys are actually fine. <laughs> oh, my God. It, hold on. I'm sorry, Box Van. That was something you probably should not have seen. Uh, yeah, that's pretty embarrassing. Why are we embarrassed about staying clean? I, I don't know. When, when did that stuff become embarrassing? I think that stuff became embarrassing when we became teenagers. I don't know. Maybe pre, pre-teenage pre years, and we just, that never grows out of us, right? Oh, okay. So, you have footage. Oh, oh so Gina has footage of the flooding. Uh, uh, supposedly, probably, I'm guessing, well, not supposedly, uh, I'm hoping that it's going to be in one of her upcoming videos. That, that would be something to see. Uh, I, I know there was a lot of damage, a lot of buildings, like under nine feet of water. That's just insane up there. Uh, oh, no one's embarrassed. Everyone's having a great time. I'm not embarrassed. I don't get embarrassed easy. I get it? Ah. <sighs> Okay, as long I, I trust you, box. I, I trust you, D. Uh, all okay here, but I think me ex's home was washed away. No grins here. Well, uh, never mind. Uh, what? I, that's probably something you could talk about on your channel. I'm sure. Uh, th th that was uh, that was pretty crazy. Uh, what, what happened up there? Three, uh, or there was two of them, and then there was a report of a possible third dam breaking all at once. That That's just, in, that's insane. Hi, Tripp and Tracy. Are you still at Thousand Trails in, Orlando, in Claremont? I will be checking in Wednesday, when, Wednesday or Thursday, somewhere around there. I forget. But I will be checking in, and I'm going to try and do some meetups. I think Expedition Greg is going to possibly be around. Uh, there's some people in the room that's going to be hanging around, like uh, Jen Vargas. And I've seen Alex in there. He might be popping in. I don't know. 
But uh, yeah, it'd be kind of cool to have a, a kind of a, a little meetup with everybody. I mean, I already know Jen. Me and Jen have been like this for ever and ever and ever. And Alex, I've been bugging him about his electronic gizmos and choices for ever and ever and ever. So, yeah, uh, Tina, if I meet our Trip and Tracy, if I meet you, I could probably complain about something that you use that, that I disagree with. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Uh, Box Van says, uh, wish I could stay, have to watch replay later. By the time you watch the replay, this gnat is going to be dead, I promise. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and uh, change up my backdrop a little bit here uh, because I do have members. I'm in. Alex can hang. Hold on here. Can hang all week on, on weekday or weekends. Uh, I don't know what the dates are. I, I'm going to be doing a live stream. I need to talk about that real fast before everyone uh, splits. And I talk and I thank everybody for being here. Uh, next Saturday, everybody knows who Gus is, right? Everybody loves Gus. If if you're a person that does not need to use ball deodorant, you probably love Gus. If you have to use this, you probably are not a big fan of Gus. I don't know. Like him, love him, hate him. He's awesome. Right? He's awesome. So next Saturday, this channel, 6 p.m. on the 30th, my next live stream, I am doing the dating game. And I've got three lovely female contestants. I'm not going to let you know who they are. Totally top secret. And the male that is going to be fighting for their attention and affection is no other than Gus. Uh, it should be fun. Um, it is going to be hosted by Tommy Travels here on my channel. And we're going to do like a massive collaboration between like six channels or something insane. I don't know how it's going to work. I'm going to come on, introduce Tommy. I'm going to sink down below and I'm going to control everything from behind the scenes. And we are going to have the dating game. It should be really fun. I hope a lot of you guys are going to show up and attend. And then afterwards... I don't know why I keep forgetting this. Bob could probably tell me what the name of the other game is. Not match game. Love love connection. I think it is. Uh, one of the channels is gonna uh, is gonna talk after the date. They're you know Gus is gonna take the lady on a date, and then uh, one of the other channels is going to be talking later in the week, having the two contestants, Gus and the winner, and. Uh, talk about the date and what it was like and was there a love connection so we're doing the dating game and love connection uh starting off on my channel it's saturday at 6 p.m and like i said hopefully everybody will tune in tommy will be there because he's going to be the game show host i could not find a better person than tommy travels if anybody watches tommy travels they know how he is on camera and how he is on the microphone he's just got that game show persona and I think it's going to be amazing having Tommy here uh, helping us out with this amazing project. Uh, okay, so before I go, let me go ahead and uh, because I just got a little bit of time left, like seconds. I want to give a big shout out to my members. Everybody back here that is blocked. Uh, Beyond Beauty 3, Artists on the Road, Tommy Travels, Box Van D, James Catanese. Uh, Bob's Adventure. I might have to get rid of Bob's picture here to get the other names. Uh, Burning Up the Roads. Uh, we got Roy and Becky's Travels, Johnny's Journeys, Buckeye Kitty, Reverend Tommy Two-Tone, Killer Whale Channel, Imagine Your Odyssey, Tammy Pilgrim from over in Hawaii, and Jen Vargas. Uh, wh why is the screen is messed? Did I pull up the wrong one? I have Jen Vargas from Central Florida Top 5. God, this right left thing is right down here, but you can't see it. But I have Jen Vargas also, and I'm going to reorganize all this stuff later for my members. Uh, thanks, everybody, for tuning in tonight. Clap, clap, clap. Let's all head over. If one of my moderators would please put the link in for Captain Jack Scrapper's channel and everybody head on over there. Let's raid him, get him started with a big shebang and uh, because I can't really put him in.
uh, Beyond Beauty, would you mind putting Captain Jack Scrapper's link in there? And let's uh, head on over his way. And then I'm going to run around like uh, Elmer Fudd with a pop gun and try and hunt down this crazy gnat. Because the cat is not doing its job. Until the next time, guys, I love you all. Peace out, everybody.